Yeah, Autism Support Gibraltar, I'm actually a committee member and pretty much one of the founder members. Uh, my son is on the spectrum, so it's always one of my first choice. Uh, I also saw the, the work that Rock Fitness Charity does for the community, so it was an automatic choice for me also. And they've been helping you on this journey. In fact, you set yourself a target. I think it was uh, 25 kilos, but you've surpassed that. You've already lost 37 in a period of four months, so you must be extremely pleased with that. Yeah, obviously, it's, it's very, I'm very proud of myself, to be honest. Uh, I had originally sent myself 20 to 25 kilos, and I've lost 37 so far with the, with the challenge finishing on Friday. So hopefully I can lose a little bit more. And, uh, you know, how have you managed to keep on track? I imagine, uh, you know, you've embarked on a, on a fitness routine and obviously controlling your diet. Yeah, I will see the diet plan and, and training. Uh, I have a, I've had a lot of help from, from people uh, keeping me on track and, and giving me support, people stopping me down the streets and giving me words of encouragement. Uh, the guys down at Pool Camp from Rock Fitness have helped me a lot, keep me motivated, pushing me along. Uh, Stephen and Lorraine down in Rock Fitness. Uh, friends and family and especially my wife who's been my personal chef, my personal nurse and my personal motivator and counsellor. So. You've obviously embarked on a journey, would you say you're here to stay, it's made you more uh, health conscious and obviously you will be going back to some of those bad habits perhaps? Yeah, definitely, uh, when I set off my first meeting with Stephen from Rock Fitness, the first thing we set out was it's a life change, lifestyle change. I had to change the way I eat, not only for myself but for my family, for my kids. I had to change everything and hopefully this, this would be the, the push that I needed. And taking on new experiences because you'd never actually done a spinning class before, so part of the project, how have you found it today? Uh, it's, it's amazing, it's, I've had lots of firsts, uh, this was my first um, spinning class, I also organised uh, with the help of, of Bianca and Janine uh, two Zumba classes, you, know, you can imagine me doing Zumba, so that was quite amazing. Uh, I also did a circuit training with the PTIs down in the MOD, and I did a spin off on outside Morrison, so they're all new experiences and a big challenge, but well worth it in the end. And Kevin Magnasco, a true example of how hard work can really pay off. Remember, you can support his cause, his Just Giving page open until the end of the year.